harken back about uh, four or five years ago and recognize that, you know, we're really not doing enough for our employees. We try and provide a level of benefits that um, keeps people here. And we try and really create an environment that's conducive to attracting and retaining employees. But, you know, we never really spend enough time face-to-face -face thanking those employees who work for the county for what they do on a day-to-day -day basis. Public service is a thankless task. I think Commissioner Beck would echo that as well. And you all know that. Don't get thanked a lot, but I tell you what, the rewards are tremendous when you have a constituent come back and say, thanks for this, thanks for the follow-up, thanks for fixing this problem. That at least is the thing that keeps me going in, in this gig. And so it's important with that in mind that we attract and we retain good employees. You guys right here with the longevity that so many of you have are the catalyst for the attraction and the retention. People out on the streets look at people that may have, I think I learned we've got one, do we have a 40 year today? Yeah, somebody has been here 40 years, it's like, okay, I, you know, that probably isn't such a bad place to be. Tenure longevity, I truly believe, breeds a desire in the part, on the part of people to, to actually come here and make county government their home. So all we want to do today is recognize the years that a number of you have put in for the county and simply tell you thank you. Um, with that, let me uh, hand this over to Commissioner Beck, and he'll tell you what you've won. <laughs> Door number three, you're right. Okay, well, I would echo, obviously, uh, the comments of Commissioner Peters, and, uh, you know, one of the things we strive to become is an employer of choice. And so these things, all we add all those things up, become that plurive in choice. So we're always looking for ways to recognize those who make it work. And, and you all are in the room. You're the ones that make it happen. Um, and, and we appreciate your efforts in doing that. So this is just one of those ways to do that. If you uh, uh, think of another way we can recognize, we're open to that. Because uh, as he said, uh, attracting and retaining good employees today is very, very difficult. And uh, we understand that. And we want to stay. Um, on top of that situation. So with that, we're going to recognize those, uh, the first group will be those who have achieved 10 years or served 10 years of service with us. Now, Erica did a fantastic job of telling me how to pronounce your name, but that doesn't mean I follow instructions well. So um, I'll do my best. If I butcher it, I still apologize up front. But <laughs> here we go. Um, if you come forward uh, for your uh, coin and certificate, and, uh, we'll, and then we'll line up over here after we get all the 10-year folks in or each year, <clears throat> and we'll go from there. So Michelle McCoy, data entry clerk. Um, also, Brenda Cromer. That uh, doesn't, that is not the entire list for the 10 years, but if you, while you're taking the photograph, I will go through other 10-year employees. Josh Ritter, Ron Upplinger, Toby Reef, Linda Fincher, Jay Schneider, Danielle Stapleton, David Schinkel, Irvin Arnold, Richard Doherty, William Roth, Karen Kuchur, Heidi DeMuth, Renee Federspiel, and Katrina Johnson are also 10-year employees who could not be here this morning. All right, the 15 years, Carrie Fluger. And I'm sorry, she, Carrie's not here, so it's going to be Adam Young. Thank you. 
Jeff Baxter. That would conclude the 15 year for the photograph. The rest would be uh, Ed Murphy, Andrea Halaski, Michelle McGrecki, Amy Wolfram, Sarah Hogue, Gary Ross, Emily Hartman, Ben Oatman, Angela Spahiv. That would be the 15 years. Okay, we'll go to the 20 years. <clears throat> Stephen Shum. Patrick Rue. That would be the 20 years in addition would be Stephanie Corman. Bob Ehrman, Philip Coons, Tameka Chapman, very good. Now the 25 years, William Stubbs. William is the only 25 year for the photograph. Mm -hmm. The other 25s would be Karen Dowdell, Hal Williams, and Timothy Brooks, and John Bodan. Okay. We'll move to 25 years. Nope, oh, I'm sorry, we're moving on to 30. Uh, David Butler, 30 years. All right, other 30 year recipients uh, Michelle Remschneider, Dean Hoffman. Did you get a picture? <laughs> yeah, all right. Move on to 35 years. And uh, our 35 year recipients are not here, but they'll mention their names is Veronica Rispa Sortiz and Mark Kiefer. All right, we'll go to the 40 year, Catherine Thornson. Okay, and I have to go back to the 10 years, Danielle Stapleton. Other, ten other ten years ago? Oh, I thought it was about oh. ten years ago. <laughs> All right. Do I have to recreate anything else, Emily? <laughs> we got one more? All right. Another ten year, Linda Fincher. Thank you. 
Okay. Have we missed anybody that's here and uh, we did not mention your name for service? Okay, we good, Erica? I think so. All right, well, once again, uh, thank you so much for what you do. You, you make the difference here in Allen County, and uh, you need to be proud of your service and, because we're proud of you. And um, I think we've got some refreshments next door, so take advantage of that, coffee and pastries or whatever you've come up with, Emily or Erica. So, again, thank you all and applause to all of you for your service. and opinions expressed do not necessarily represent those of Access Fort Wayne, the Allen County Public Library, or any other supporting group. If you or anyone you know might be interested in making a television show, please call 260-421-1250. Access Fort Wayne is a department of the Allen County Public Library. The views and opinions expressed do not necessarily represent those of Access Fort Wayne, the Allen County Public Library, or any other supporting group. If you or anyone you know might be interested in making a television show, please call 260-421-1250. Access Fort Wayne is a department of the Allen County Public Library.